upcoming. So there's not a preset in, in Audition like radio, so I just found a really cool template that really simulates the radio voice. So I just want to click on this preset. What's happening guys, my name is Alex, it's Friday, it's me, it's a new video, uh, audition tutorial of course, and first of all, before we're gonna begin this video, thank you guys so much for, you know, the continued support, you guys absolutely destroyed last episode of Sony Vegas, like, how to make rainbow tech, you guys have really destroyed that video, it's crazy, you can find it in the description, um, as previous video, I'll put the link there so you can see it, but today I'm gonna show you guys how to make this radio voice, so let's say you wanna have, you wanna edit your audio and stuff, and you wanna have that, this radio-ish kind of voice, I'm gonna show you guys how to do that, so I th would say, without further ado, let's jump right into it. Alright, so as you can see, like, last episode, like, you need to record something before you can do it um so i'm just gonna pick this um stereo of course my microphone and the output just my uh, stereo my speakers boom okay so let's record something and we're gonna put this we're gonna put effects on it but i'll show you guys how to do it i'm just gonna go aim for record as always boom and let's record something all right so this is just a test i'm gonna show you guys how to make a radio voice like how to add the effect so it adds so it sounds really good so let's go okay that's the audio let's see how it's how it sounds all right so this is just a test i'm going to show you guys how to make a radio voice like how to add the effect so it adds so it sounds really good so let's go yep and, yeah indeed let's go so the thing you need to do is you want to go to the effects rack of course as always and you want to click on this arrow and you want to pick reverb full reverb basically you cannot edit it as you can see it's not clickable that's because this one is still you know aim for record is still on you want to just put that off and then it becomes available so there's not a preset in, in audition like radio voice so i just found out a really cool template that really simulates the radio voice so i just want to click on this preset drop down menu and you want to pick medium vocal plate and let's see how it sounds by itself all right so this is just a test i'm going to show you guys how to make a radio voice like how to add the effect so it adds so it sounds really good so let's go it sounds pretty good so that's it for the effects radio voice if you ever listen to radio online especially with headphones you can hear like there's a lot of bass to it so that's what we're gonna do as well so we're just gonna go to a mixer and we're gonna pick this first track of course you just want to click on this one to put on the equalizer and then you want to click on the icon underneath it and then you just want to mess around with this one the bass marker let's see how it sounds all right so this is just a test i'm going to show it's pretty good but i'm just going to add a little bit more bass to it show you guys how to make a radio voice like how to add the effect so it adds so it sounds really good that's actually the good thing uh, about bass so we're done with that the next thing you want to do is you want to mess around with the second marker um let's see how it sounds when i move it so let's go let's play it again all right, so this is just a test. I'm going to show you guys how to make a radio voice, like how to add the effect so it adds, so it sounds really good. So let's go. Yeah, that sounds good. So I'm going to leave this one uh, down here, as you can see. Because if I play it back, you you can hear you know, the difference. It's pretty pretty big. All right, so this is just a test. I'm going to show you guys how to. That's coming very close. So let's move on to the next marker see uh, what we can do with that make a radio voice like how to add the effect so it adds so it sounds really good so let's go so i put this one a little bit like a little below this one actually almost the same i think yeah but let's put it as equal as, as low as it is as the first marker um let's see how it sounds with that all right so this is just a test i'm going to show you guys how to make a radio voice like how to add the effect so it so that sounds pretty good so i think we should leave um those markers but the last one you want to bring that up to make it a little bit more uh like crisp sound let's see how it sounds all right so this is just a test i'm going to show you guys how to make a radio voice like how to add the effect so it adds so it sounds really good so let's go that sounds pretty good. So I think we're done with the effects. So let's close this out and have a comparison. So this is uh, the recording without. All right, so this is just a test. I'm gonna show you guys how to make a radio voice. And this is with. Like how to add the effect so it adds. So it sounds really good. All right, so this is just a test. I'm gonna without? show you guys how to make a radio voice. Like with. how to add the effect so it adds. So it sounds really good. So let's go. 
It sounds pretty good, so let's see. I'm just gonna turn it off and on so you guys can hear it, so enjoy. All right, so this is just a test. I'm gonna show you guys how to Without? make a radio voice, like how to add the effect so it adds. Voice. So it sounds really good, so let's go. So that's how simple it is, guys. Just add, you know, the reverb, um, this vocal stereo play effect, and just mess around with the equalizer, as you can see this one. You, I think you should bring this those down a bit in the bass up. And um, that's how simple it is, guys. So if you want to see more of those Adobe Audition CS6 tutorials every Monday and Friday at 12 p.m. PST, make sure to smash that like button. If you don't want to miss out any new content, make sure to subscribe down below. I want to thank you guys for the continued support, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for a Adobe Illustrator tutorial. So I will see you guys tomorrow. It's me again. Um, I know I, have, I haven't uploaded a video uh, for a while on this channel. You know, all the kind of movies was a great actor uh, the past several months. Uh, basically, uh, some of you may know uh, that I'm a partner with Media Crowd. Let me explain. It's on the comment section down below. So I'm just gonna uh, put this completely random. Thank you guys, and I'll see you guys next week.